when people start hearing about living within this movement or starting to adopt some of its best practices, um, some of the assumptions that come out is that either people are stingy with their money or they don't spend on things that make them happy. And I found that that couldn't have been farther from the truth. Tell us a little bit of examples, whether it's in your life or otherwise, that FIRE actually has given you the freedom to be more generous where you want to be intentional and also are spending on things that can make you actually happy. Yeah, I think that's a great point. I, I, and, and the whole exercise that we discussed about analyzing your expenses is a great place to start with that because sometimes we're spending money on things we don't even know about, whether it's subscriptions or or just kind of looking at some of the bigger expenses like housing and transportation and food and realizing that some small changes in your life could make a huge impact. So 